Uh, right, okay, uh, so I thought I'd go for a, a different visual for uh, number six. I thought it was 100 quid in there. I haven't poured anything into it yet. Uh, yeah, more of the same, I guess. Right, uh, yeah. I could make some very inappropriate jokes about this machine, but <laughs> I won't bother. I'm just hoping something's going to change. As you can see, nothing's changed there. Although I'm doing it in a bit more daylight, so we don't get the glare today. The only glare you're going to get is me in the background, as you can see me. Is that £25 block? There you go. That's gone to 75 once, so I mean, that's the only thing that I'm holding on to. I mind seeing a few more decent wins come off it. Uh, apparently, spoons are planning on reopening in June, allegedly, anyway. I kind of think the government might have something to say about whether they're going to reopen or not. Although, to be honest with you, it's just one of them things at the moment. Nobody seems to know anything, do they? Doesn't look like there's anything there. Definitely getting through some hours on this thing, if nothing else. Yeah, so it's mugged me off with a 240 again. Uh, somebody mentioned in last video about changing those in the settings in your test mode. Unfortunately, you can't. I have checked. Um, so they're not the same as JPM. Just really because I'm sick of them hardly bloody moving, to be honest with you. At least G JPM had the decency to start them on like 120 and 80. Go on, love a gamble. The, gen the, the uh, gamble has got sort of more generous in terms of giving good numbers more frequently. I have noticed that. I won't mind seeing it get to 75 again a couple more times. But yeah, this could be ut utterly brutal, couldn't it, I suppose. I should have some more coin mechs in the next day or two because I know they're on the way back. They should be back tomorrow, I think. And uh, my friend, uh, my friend Darren, better known to YouTube World as Crest, is sending me a little care package over with something of use to me as well, which would be quite nice. I've got a package coming up from Boo, so I've got quite a few things supposedly coming back to me at some point. Hopefully they'll all turn up. So I'll definitely be what when we get out of lockdown. I'll be having a bit of a clear out, I think, of machines and getting some different ones. I'm staggered how often it doesn't give you that stop, even though it's basically being forced.
One thing I am getting better at is feeding a fruit machine whilst holding a camera and playing it at the same time. <laughs> I'm actually slowly getting better at doing that. Seems to find the odd few that won't go in though. Of course, if it wasn't for lockdown, I probably wouldn't have ever tried doing this. Well, no probably about it, I wouldn't have tried doing this. Why would I? Maybe should have took me two quid then for a gamble. Not taking pounds or... Fiver? No. Yeah, I, I, I kind of feel like I agree with what Rich is saying about... Uh, how they're designed, I think. I, I think this would probably. Wowzers. It's a rare picture. Um, I think this would probably just keep giving me 30 quid, 30 quid, 30 quid for God knows how long. And then eventually I think it would just roll it in anyway. We're back at 25 again. It's a death, isn't it? Yeah, seems to like to kill you if it gives you a three or a four for it. Oh, it's nice to see it give a tenner. Maybe it's slowly softening up. I don't really want to do that, I should have just ignored it. <laughs> just the excitement that it's given me a couple of stops. Wow. It's about a hundred yesterday. So that puts it at like 320 ish before this video started. Yeah, that's done the £2.40 thing. It loves doing that. It's like it knows what I'm doing. <laughs> I think it offered me a stop then. Not that I would have took it for a freaking quid. I can see that 100 quid slowly going down. Wow. That was a bit unnecessary. Yeah, of course it's not there. It's a weird little profile, isn't it? I mean, you imagine you got into a, I don't know, a cops at 300 quid in. At 300 quid in, it would be, uh, it'd be begging you to take 15 pound wins off the bottom and 20 quid wins. It'd be throwing them at your left, right and centre. This almost doesn't look like it get, oh, for fuck's sake, like it even gets buzzed up really, does it? If it does throw me a blue board and it gives me a centre, if it's near on nudges, I will be, uh, I will be playing it. If it's offering me nothing, I, I probably won't be. To be honest with you, I think it is worth the risk. I mean, currently at this stage, I've not seen one more than about forty quid being offered from the middle. And I wouldn't think, I think 40 quid at this point's a fucking drop in the ocean, innit? Mm. Don't 
ito rin yan. It's weird that one pound from the feature every time has turned into three. Four boards I think I've had off it. I've had three pound three times now. That's not a mistake, is it? Pick up this one off the floor. So drop the odd one. It's determined to give you a quid in it. I mean, to be fair, that tenner of free cash pots is just given off um, off stop. That's as much as it can give you. That or bells. Just don't mind it throwing the odd nudge at you for seven quid and going, yeah, I may have seven quid. Or it just go, do you know what, have some lemons. I mean, even holding start downs a bit uh, a bit harder now because it's pretty much trying to hold just about every other press. So, normal one. You gonna mug me off for three quid? Yep. <laughs> Unbelievable. That's definitely changed in its programming as you as I as I played it as it's got stupidly happy. That it's just literally throwing three pound every board pretty much at me at the moment. Nothing there, no. No, cherries. Wow, fucking hell, they miss them. Out of shock. <laughs> brilliant. That's fucking brilliant. I think it surprised itself that it given me 15 quid to gamble with and went, actually, mate, that was a mistake. I meant to give you a pound. That would be a piss take if it threw two nudges in at that stage. Although it's only like still less than 50 quid. Clearly cash pot's pretty blocks on it anyway, you would imagine, so. Do you think it's there? I can't be asked looking, but I would imagine not. Just imagine if I had a bit three and it was there, eh? <laughs> no stop. I'm kind of just willing it to do, to just decide it's going to pop. <laughs> or do something of interest. Even if that's now just for the video's sake. Or just to stave off my boredom. I can imagine I've had a good, a decent um, rose return by this point. Yeah. Even the big wins aren't getting more frequent, are they? <laughs> Favourite doesn't want to give a nudge. Dog's barking. Oh, that's giving me a nudge. A whole nudge, eh? About 20 quid. There's a three on the 25 for the kill. Could have been nice and just give me two nudges, couldn't it? That would have been brilliant if it had done it. There's no three quid coming in. Happy days. Five? No, oh, wow. I'll have the pound. You've messed up there, machine. You've messed up there, indeed. If 
15 minutes. That's all we've got left. I've got a couple of quid in my hand, maybe a tenner. I mean, when that gets down to 20 quid, that'll be, what, 400? Sorry, I've been a spud and forgot it comes to it only goes to 50 credits. You'd think by now I'd remember that. Nudges. Do you fancy me two this time? No. I mean, it is actually playing... Moderate, moderately better at the moment. <laughs> Where is all the value going? No, that is what we need to know. I'm only really holding them in hope that it's going to let me get a tenner. I feel like um, my three pound board's on its way round again. Any time. Oh, hello. Wow. Yep, it's over fucking 25. Not for long. <laughs> there it is. It, it was due, wasn't it? When it drops a six off the start, it pretty much just gives you the quid, thankfully. I've not had it drop me six and five in yet to decide to just give me the bloody 240 I don't want. It does get, you do get a feeling it's doing more, finally. How much more, I don't know. That rigid 25 block's not as, not as rigid at the moment. Still hasn't made it back to 75 yet, has it? You'd imagine if it gets to say over 75, it'll just go through. That is, that is the final block for it, so. Be interesting to see what sort of afters it'd have in it after it does pot. I mean, you'd think it's going to be off its fucking tits for about three days. <laughs> just keep giving you over and over again, giving you over's returns. As a way of an apology. At least I feel the gamble's been a bit more interesting so far this video. Just like it to just smash in bell, 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 bell and just go thanks a lot. Thanks for coming, there's 250 quid. And its favourite loose square. I mean, that's pretty much made mincemeat of 100 quid, hasn't it? Three quid board. You no know, blue? Of course you're fucking not. You are gonna give me two pound forty again, aren't you? I'm just gonna hold it there, look. There you go. You know a big three quid for the boys? And girls, I guess. There's some girls that do watch my channel. Not as many as there are blokes, I'll tell you now. But everybody's welcome. Bastard. Can't be asked holding for it again. <laughs> I 
This is the epitome of boredom. It might just give me a nudge. No. At least go for me £10 stop then, can't I? I mean, there's just no way of making this interesting. Absolutely no way of making it interesting. Even the addition of putting a bucket there full of money is just not made it any better. In my eyes, anyway. Big seven quid. Fifteen. Boom. It's waiting to die. Keep up with the tradition of nothing. There's no fucking wins. It's our board cycling round for another wonderful three quid. Probably. <laughs> I barely bother looking up the reels at all now. Just can't be arsed. Might be four cherries there, you just never know. Of course there's not. Five. Oh no. Right, it's not done it yet. Oh, it might do it for the first time. Oh no, it's, it's actually six, six, wasn't it? Good, happy days. No big quid. So in a hundred pounds worth of credits, so we're getting on towards a hundred pounds worth of credits. We're still less than 20 quid, but if you think about it, it's only going to have taken about, when it when I'm done, it's only going to have taken about 75 quid. Oh, I could have stopped for my grapes there, just to have a gamble. Um, yeah, so it'll only have taken about 75 quid, so it's paid 50, 25 of it back out, hasn't it? In wins that I've not wanted. But it's going to keep giving me the little thrown in boards. It's, there's no way around it, is there? Well, there is. I mean, I could just plug it every time it did it, but I'm not going to do that. I got myself into this mess. <laughs> I don't know what's going to get me out of it. Probably nothing. Is there anything of note? No, the flaming isn't. I could have got three. I could have got three melons on the line. I don't even bother bending down to look anymore. I'm just literally an autopilot. No, don't want that. Almost begging it to just roll it in. I think I'm, feel like I'm even picking up the pace slightly from the last two videos. Come on, Corey, do something exciting. There you go. Not even a ten and a three, six, nine quid there is there left now. We're up to twenty quid. I think it'd be about twenty-five, twenty-six quid by the time it's done. We'd have to recycle that as well, so it'll have had another hundred and twenty-five quid's worth of play.
25, 25 minutes to get through nearly 100 quid. I think the last one for the whole video was like 33, wasn't it? So this one potentially is going to be a bit longer, but just purely because it's... Nudge. Nudge. Hey. If you ask it nicely. Why does it tell you what the normal board exchange is when you've already got it? Just flash for it and just say, I'm there. So what do we think? Three or a four? If you, said, if you thought it was a three, you were right. See, I caught it going out that time, didn't I? Yeah, I'll, I'll treat you all and pull it back. Three. Four. Four. Six. If he wants to let me. Six. Great if you went blue on there, eh? So you've got one bell there and you've got one bell down there. So I don't see any, there's one other one there. I don't see the point of even bothering. Oh, well, it's still, it's still blue, how cool is that? I didn't even notice that, I think it went back to normal. It was just flashing out and went back normal. Should we push it just cause it's, got, see it's still blue? Or is it not gonna matter? I just wanna do something different, so. Sack it, let's have a board. Offering 35 at the moment. No, mugged off again. Yeah, you just watch the bank, it banking more money up for us. There's another 25 quid, that's going to prolong the video, isn't it? Oh, good. You know that part of Brewster's Millions where uh, he uh, gets rid of loads of the money and then he ends up getting some of the money back again? Uh, or he's back to where he started, back to square one? That's what that feels like. I know it's sort of self-inflicted. I could have taken a quid, but... At least we've got to see something different, eh? I don't think in the grand scheme of things it's actually going to make that much difference. And we got to see something different, rather than me just gambling the high-low out and it going nowhere. I can't think it has too much effect on it really, to be honest with you. 25 quid's a drop in the bloody ocean. When you put 400 through. Yeah, weird footprints, that's a dog walking past on the laminate floor. Somebody's decided to let him in. And he dare say he's waiting for his tea as well. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off, Corey. Don't give me a five. 
jak more light, there's a lot more of them in this machine than that. Right back to square one, eh? To be fair, we've, uh, we're about 31 minutes into the vid and we must have gone 125 quid's worth of recycling. Seems rather pointless at this stage, but we'll uh, take a gamble on for a bit. Half expected to bin me on that three. No, I did on the five instead. <laughs> that can tell you you're only at one place. At three. Been too many videos where nobody's complained about my recording skills. You wait till I get to frigging real fruits or somewhere, and you all be whinging again. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, I've just, I think I've just lost the plot for a minute then. <laughs> I got three quid when I didn't want three quid. Yeah, everybody be whinging when I get back to playing machines in the wild again. So I do play them fast. Can't help it, it's just kind of the way I am. I've always played fruities pretty quickly. And playing them fast, you do make mistakes as well. Especially if you don't play them a lot. Some of them are like almost a test of memory to remember what to do. And then you also have to remember a lot of the machines, like, I'll have played them on a different jackpot, like I'll have played them on 15 quid or whatever when they were out originally, not on a fiver, and they do play differently, they do different things. Can't be arsed. Well, we're rattling through that 45 quid, if nothing else. I nearly accidentally nudged a cherry in them. weird how when it gets to offering you 75 quid which let's be honest that was probably like 150 quid ago it didn't go back up there again that has gone past the 25 pound block since but it hasn't gone back all the way up there
going to fly through the 40 minutes here, aren't we? You know, I wasn't even looking then at all. I actually genuinely was not looking at that four. Sometimes I bother to look, but I wasn't then. <laughs> Absolutely nowhere near looking anymore at some of these things. I won the win. That's over 50 again. So they oh, throwing quids around now. Get them in a bit. I need a brew after this video. <laughs> I'm going to edit them together as well because I'm easily going to go over 40 minutes, aren't I? I've still got, yeah, I've still got about another 15 quid or so to stick into it yet. And I've got two on the floor. That's what we've got there. Gonna nick down and get these. A couple of quid off the floor. Doing a little bit better this time in terms of getting quids instead of threes. If they hadn't messed up before, it would be less. just in case the orange was there. Four of a kind wins have been absolutely scarce as anything. In fact, to be fair, even £10 wins have been pretty scarce. We've had three bells once, three cash pots once, four cherries once, and four lemons once. It's not bad for memory, is it? ever own this machine or one like it do not play like this <laughs> just play it the way it was intended on being played by Doris in the local con club putting her uh, putting a pension in in 1995 I fancy a gamble on the ILO. Just not, I'm just not taking one until it gives me a couple of quid at least. Yeah, I said I fancied a gamble on the high low. Not, I fancied one single gamble on the high low and then you go, see you later. That wasn't what we planned. I've nearly got rid of Brewster's millions, that's something. And we've nearly approached the, uh, 40, well, over the 40 minute mark, so I'll have hit the 4 gig limit or whatever it is on the videos. So that means a bit of editing work for me to do tonight. It, winning a gamble would be great. Yeah, well, I, it's overrated giving me the nudges, give me cherries. Can't believe how well this coin mech's held up when it's not even from this machine. It's done a very good job.
Yeah, you lot are lucky you can skip. I haven't skipped a second of this. I've played every single spin. You do realise that it gives me a cash pot, I'm going to call it done, yeah? <laughs> Even if it is 50 odd quid. Oh, I didn't want the cherries. I wasn't even looking at what was blooming that nudging in then. Go on, we'll take it on right from the bottom. Hopefully it'll kill me now. I'll go all the way, I don't care which. Has anyone kept count? See where we're up to yet. 15. I'm dead. <sighs> Yeah, well, that's that 45 quid gone back in it now as well, so. Well, it must have been due. Loves a little funny spin, doesn't it? Not five, thank you. I mean, unless I hadn't approved how much money had gone in, I don't think anyone would believe me. <laughs> Richard might believe me, but he's probably the only one that would. You are taking the piss, give me a four of a kind win. I even my arms starting to get tired at this point. I'm actually a little surprised. I'm actually a little surprised how poor that was. Just give me three nudges and I'm going to call it a jackpot. <laughs> I won't really. If he rolls it in, I fucking will. Right, last seven quid, and then we can wrap up another part. Now this has made Ace of Clubs look like the best chase of all time, you know that, don't you? So I think I think I can only conclude that a blue mode is meant to give you the rover's return. Maybe it has to be happy enough to give you a rover's return. I don't fucking know. Because it blocked it for ages, didn't it? You think about back back now to video number one. In video number one, it was just point blank refusing to give you the last one. And yeah, every time I've had a blue mode now. In the last few, I should help that. In the last few videos, it's just followed exactly the same pattern every single time, and given it. So I guess what you would deduce from it, if you were playing one in the wild and you had a DeLorean, um, would be that if it didn't just drop you onto that square straight away at the start, and then that square straight after it, pretty much, uh, that you should really be taking one of them features because it hasn't got a rovers in it. Although you would imagine, judging by how this plays, it would always have had a Rovers in it. Ah, 
Right, that's the last quid. I will see if I can get a gamble for last quid, but it's not looking too likely. It's uh, gone into its shell again, hasn't it? Uh, that concludes the vid. Um, I find it very hard to say. I hope you've enjoyed it. <laughs> On to the next one.